Hello and good morning, good afternoon, good evening, or good night whenever you watch this. This is uh, our continued uh, midweek manna topic for this month and called Believing Bigger. Finding out who you are in God, what your purpose is in God, and just believing bigger for things in your life. And so this morning, I want to talk about a stillness. Uh, slow miracles. You know, we live in a world of instant gratification. We want things right now. You know, we want to, if somebody texts us, we want them to text us right back. If we put deposits in the bank, we, it takes seconds now as opposed to days. Uh, channel options are a lot more than they used to be. When I grew up, we had ABC, NBC, CBS, and that was it. And TV went off at midnight. You have the, the flag waving on all the channels and midnight was when it went off. And so when we think about living in an instant gratification time, we tend to think that God is slow when we are seeking a blessing or we're asking for a response to a prayer. The reality is that God's timing is always God's timing. It's unfortunate that we want God to work on our time when the reality is that we need to work on God's time. And when we ask and pray about things and God is slow to respond, we think that God don't see us or God doesn't hear us, God doesn't love us, or maybe God's even disappointed in us. When it rouses that maybe the blessing is on its way, but it's just not here yet. Maybe God is, is preparing you for the blessing because you may pray about something and ask God about something and yet this might not be the time for God to bless you with whatever you have asked for. And so sometimes that blessing takes a little bit longer to come to you. But I will encourage you that if you're waiting on a blessing from God, don't give up. I guarantee you that it will show up at some point because God is always there uh, indeed to bless us. Psalm 84, 11 says, for the Lord God is a sun and shield. God bestows favor and honor. No good thing does God withhold from those who walk uprightly. So as long as you and I continue to do what we are called to do uh, as beloved children of God, God will continue to listen to us. God loves us. We can never disappoint God. And hold on, your blessing is on the way. I hope that this uh, message has touched you in some way. Uh, feel free to share with other people, and I will see you back here tonight, this evening, this morning at 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Take care. God bless.